I'm here with head women's basketball coach Rose Howard after the 59 to 49 victory over Keith. Now, coach obviously came out strong, you know, tempo, and then we seemed to kind of like lag off. Just explain. Well, you know, I, I think it was a really physical game, and um, you know, it kind of hurts us to have two starters out right now and, and trying to get people to do some things that they're not used to doing. But I was really, I was really happy that we hung in there, and we it was, a, you know. Both teams fought hard, and, and in the end, when the most pressure was on, we kind of figured out our offense, which we can't seem to do. And I pointed that out to him, like, in the, in the times were tough, you guys figured out your offense and you relaxed. So, you know, I was happy about that. Um, and, and I was happy with the way they fought through the whole game, but we still need we still need to gain some confidence in offense. And I felt like Mallory definitely had a better second half, you know, a little, I wouldn't say wild, but a little out of control in the first half. Um, and obviously, you know, Julia President stepped up big for us tonight. Just talk about the play of both of them. Right, and and again, we talk about you know offensively, those are the two kids that you, you know they can score, they want to score. Um, and, and I felt like you know one of those fouls Mallory got in the first half probably wasn't a foul, but it is what it is. And uh, it was happy that she stayed on the bench and she stayed ready, and she came out in the second half. And I thought she really, you know, at time got some key rebounders and, and some key shots and then some key passes too to the outside to um, you know, help us win the game. Um, you know, what's a lesson that you can take, obviously take away from a game, game like this, you know, tight game, you know, you have to kind of find something inside yourself to kind of get the victory. Well, you know, again, I told them after the game I was proud of them because we're playing the seven, seven, nine, and, and we're playing two starters down. And um, it, it's what I've told this team the whole year is, you know, the championships are won now in this part of the season when you build character and, and you build confidence in games like that. And I felt like tonight they kind of finally took, you know, the bull by the horns and decided that they wanted to win this game because they could have very easily lost this game tonight. Um, so I, I think there's a lot of lessons in this that pay off down the road. And we need to be in these tight games and we need to kind of figure out who we are in these tight games. And finally, you know, we have a game with Notre Dame Saturday. I mean, probably, you know, obviously a team that maybe you'd overlook, but, you know, the way we, our track record can't really overlook anybody. Right. Well, and, and we're playing to get better and the kids need to understand that. And we're, you know, it doesn't matter who we're playing, we need to show up because we need to get better each night so that at the end of the season we're kind of peaking and we're the team that we want to be. So um, it doesn't really matter to me who we're playing, we should still be playing at the same level. Okay, thank you. Thank you. That is Head Coach Rose Holler after the 59-49 victory over Keystone.